guys welcome back to rogue tv we are going to do something a little bit different and unique at least on this channel um we are going to do something that i simply call the 90s and i want you to guys let me know if this is a good idea or not so we're going to start off with uncle sam i don't want i don't ever want to see you again the official video now for those who are listening to my channel that grew up in the 90s my question to you is where did all the good music go to? There's some good music out here, some today, but this stuff in the 90s was so much better. Now, with that being said, there's a lot of music in the 90s that I did listen to. So this one here is actually a review. I guess it could be considered a reaction because I was young when I listened to this and I, I didn't really listen to the music for the lyrics at the time. So I am going to actually concentrate on the lyrics this time around and see uh, what he's actually talking about. If you're new to the channel, please like, comment, subscribe down below. I do upload three to five videos a day, seven days a week. And again, let me know if you like the idea of doing playlists like the 70s, the 80s, the 90s. The 2000s songs from those from those eras, like I grew up, I grew up in the 80s, but I really didn't get into the music until the 90s because that's when I was in my teenage years. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into this and see what the song is actually about. No, see, your love is ending and mine is just beginning. Like, that is so messed up that his friend, he said a close friend of yours, so I assume like one of his best buddies, like so close you're like brothers, sent him this letter. Man, and on top of that, let's talk about this guy's voice, man. Where did all the good music go to? is ending and my life's just beginning with a woman that I know you hold dear to you and it made me want to say I don't ever want to see you again I don't, I don't but I stuck by you till the end and my conscience is clear and I can move on from him but I Like, I will never understand, and this works both ways, but girls are always, girls in general, always talking about guys are dogs, this, that, and the other. They're cheaters and this, that, and the other. However, you find that one good guy that treats you 100% correct, loyal, respectful, all the good things that you're looking for, all the good qualities. And then you turn around and stab him in the back. Come on, dude. This is why this is this works both ways. This is why people have insecurities when when they're trying to move into one relationship to another. This is why that second girlfriend or second boyfriend, whoever, has to deal with the insecurities. It's because of what that guy or that girl went through in the relationship prior. Loyalty is earned. You got to earn that trust. You got to earn it. 
Once you break it, it's so hard to get back. I wish I could say the same for you, baby. Not only did he lose two people that he loved, I mean, not only did he lose one, but he lost two people that he loved. The girl and his best friend. Now, see, his best friend is just more at fault than the girl is. The best friend should have known better. Like, that's hands off, not, not yours, don't touch, belongs to somebody, They're, she's in a relationship. You, you don't chase that down, especially if y'all been friends beforehand. Oh. I was true to my love for you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It took me a minute to wake up and see me. What the love of my life was doing to me. I wanted to lay down and die. Cause my pride wouldn't let me cry. Somehow. He said he couldn't understand until he felt your touch. Now he can see why I love you so much. And that's so unfair. I never thought I'd have to share. You love that I thought was give it to only me. And that's why I'll never want to see you again. I don't want to see you again. you love close and your so enemies even closer but I can't win for losing you are the closest thing cause the to one me, I thought baby. was a friend to me ended up being my true enemy go ahead and say this too if, if you're one of the ones that are messing around on your significant other and you come across this reaction because you have a guilty conscience and you're watching this video and you you're, you like uncle sam and i don't ever want to see you again and this relates to you because you are the one that's doing that to your significant other stop is it really worth it stop it Makes no sense, man, to tear somebody down like that. It just.
All right, guys, that was Uncle Sam. I don't ever want to see you again. Now, you heard the things that I said. The, the things that I said earlier. Now, keep in mind that if you are in a new relationship and you're insecure because of what happened to your old relationship and this stuff happened to you, do not make that next person pay for that mistake. Do not make that because that person that you're with now, your new relationship could be the one that is 100% loyal, faithful, and has all the good qualities. But I'm telling you, if you make her or him suffer for your past relationships, you may be missing out on a good thing because they're going to leave you. They're not going to put up with it. Guys, if you're new to the channel, please comment, like, and subscribe down below. If you do subscribe, make sure you hit the bell button and click all and get all of my notifications because I do upload three to five videos a day, seven days a week. Also, if you made it to the end, let me know what you thought about the song. If it's your first time hearing it, if you agree with me, what is your, what is it that you can relate to on this song? Let me know down in the comments, guys. You have a good night.